Stan Boney. And I'm Mandy Knoll. We begin tonight with two breaking news stories. First, Youngstown State has decided on the short-term future of Malik Richmond. The Super Steubenville football player convicted of rape against a 16-year-old girl in 2012. Richmond is on the YSU football team and will remain on the team as a practice player. He will not be allowed to play in any games this season and will forfeit a year of eligibility. Richmond was wearing number 96 in YSU's early practices. In a statement released this evening, the university explained how Richmond enrolled last fall, inquired about playing, walked on, tried out, and made the 105-man roster. It does not say what will happen after the season, but adds that YSU does not restrict any student taking part in extracurricular activities as long as they are in good standing. The statement also addresses sexual assault by stating, quote, Youngstown State University takes the matter of sexual assault very seriously and continues to educate everyone within the campus community about the impact and prevention of sexual assault. YSU is committed to eradicating sexual assault and educating our students beyond the classroom in order to be productive members of society.